absolutely nothing left to chance, except for the fact I didn't turn on my light. There we go. Nothing left to chance. Just pure Mega Man action. Hey, everybody. Got my password all pulled up. I think I still feel the shadow of this game. Like, I was cranking down on the controller so hard. But I think it, uh... <laughs> I think it made my like forearm tweak out a little bit. Uh, yeah, I did get a new statue, or rather, to be on it, or to be specific, Steph did. But yes, hold on a second. Let's show them Behold, look at him. He's blue. Some people say he looks even more like me, but I think it's more whimsical. It's more streamery. Steph's actually setting up a home office in another room, so she's gonna take the original Moai head, and this guy's gonna be our new stream buddy. Yeah, it's blue! Uh, another thing that's important to note about today's stream, I've moved this table. It used to be here, now it's there. Uh, because this is a fireplace. Uh, and I'm gonna burn some stuff in there later. Uh, I'm gonna, f for candle cams, we're gonna, we're gonna upgrade candle cam today. Candle cam is gonna be back there and it's gonna be a roaring toaster, toasty fire. Uh, I think I'm gonna gonna get going with that when I start on Dark Tide. That should be in about an hour and a half, which incidentally is about the time, or is the time that I have to see what I can do with Mega Man. Oops. So what button do you reckon changes these numbers? It's X. I guess that makes sense. Maybe the game after all. I guess that would have been Y on a Super Nintendo controller. Start. Ah, yes, my state reloaded to perfection like I just left it. Is it cold where you are? No. I am, I am in LA, Los Angeles. It never gets cold here. Occasionally, it gets like hoodie weather. Like, woo, that's about as, as, as frosty as it gets. I don't think I dealt with this dude's stage too much. Yeah, trash, trash bandic, trash bandicoot. There we go. It genuinely isn't fair, California weather. We don't deserve it. Tunnel Rhino! I have to do it. Every time. I just hear it in my head, so it comes out. Did it remember my controls? It did not! <sighs> so you have to set that and then put in the damn password? Mm -hmm. mm, maybe safe states are the way to do this. Uh, that's fine. Why is there no reset? Okay, fine, I'll just do that. Tunnel Rhino. Yeah, we get droughts. Yeah. We get droughts, we get mudslides, we get earthquakes, we get wildfires. So we're not immune from weather, that's for sure. It's just more that, uh, it's kind of like it stores it up. Instead of every day being a little miserable, it's just apocalyptic all at once. And then every day is just an impossible, an impossible explosion of sunshine and beauty. So vapid actors can walk out on their ocean view terraces in their silk robes and feel like they're king of the goddamn world because they are. I guess you wouldn't be doing that in LA though, you'd be in like, Alabama. I don't know, Steph has a better layout of the, uh... That's a better lay of the land when it comes to the distribution of populace. Maybe up in the Hollywood Hills? I'm gonna work my way up there. It's the only thing I, uh, only thing I stream for anymore. Is to break into the Hollywood Hills. I need to live next to, uh, Christopher Walken or something. It's still drought after 40 plus years. I mean, it's uh, it's gone it's gone through various severities of drought, but I don't know that it's ever exited drought. 
Minifig1. Thank you very much for the sub. Tunnel Rhino! Tunnel Rhino. Go Tunnel Rhino. Okay. A fresh stage ready to be plumbed for upgrades and secrets. Yes. Yes. What fresh beauties will I find? I've only f I found two sub tanks, three heart tanks. Oh wait, no, I've played this stage. I remember jumping up there. Yeah. Ah! Maybe I didn't jump up here. I'm going through all the Mega Man X's. Yes. I played X1 and X. Well, actually, I'm going through all the Mega Mans. I played through X. Played through the like the OG series. This is like going back to 2015, if it counts that long ago. But anyway, uh, yeah. Played through X X1 and X2. I figure I might as well keep going. And then screw it, the Game Boy Mega Mans. I never played Battle Network. I never played uh, Legends. So there's a lot of good Mega Man out there that I haven't played. And I haven't played Mega Man Zero since it came out. This is interesting. There's a nice little branch path. Oh no, wait, that's right. Yeah. Just missed those streams? That was a long time ago, Captain. I think the last time I played Mega Man X was like early 2019. If the YouTube uploads or anything to go by, what's up, Marzard? Good to see you again. Yes, uh, my rules. I don't remember the game that well. Actually, I don't know that I... Well, I did play through X3 as part of a collection before. I certainly don't remember a whole lot about it. I will, uh, I, I won't look anything up. I'll instead rely on sage guidance and collected knowledge. Okay, how did I not? Huh. All right. The sage wisdom of, uh, of Twitch chat. A communal wisdom. Well, that's right, because I got to the, I got to the screen that had the heart tank on it, and then it just dashed off and died. That's right. I've already beaten Vile, and I've beaten Bite. He's here. The, uh, the only thing I, I would, like, the only thing I would ask, the only act of guidance I am soliciting is a warning if I'm about to miss something that I can't go back and get later. An upgrade or, like, an encounter. So, like, in X2, if, if you, like, finish all the stages before you beat all the sub-bosses, there's some stuff you can't get. That sort of thing. And I know that only gets more intense as the X series goes on. I don't know if X4 has that, but I think 5 sure does. 5 is when it you have to, like, rescue the Reploids, and that's how you get upgrade parts and stuff. So if you miss one, you just don't get it, that, that save file. Have you get zero killed yet? Uh, wait, did I? I don't think so. Do I need to die a zero? Did something happen? I've gotten trapped in the menu where you can summon him. What about obtaining an item that prevents you from getting another? Would you want to know about that so you can make an informed choice? Yes. Are you talking about the chips? Because I thought I thought you could just go back to the, like where the, well anyway, the answer is yes. I guess. Any any decision of no return, whether that's like clearing too much of too many levels before doing a particular thing. Here are the chips. If you get one of them before the final stages, you can't get the one that combines them into a single unit. Oh, the, the gold chip? Okay, so don't get a chip, is what I'm being told. I like it. I think that's that's my ideal experience playing these these games in particular, or really maybe a Metroidvania in general, is, is getting like 100% guidance, but only only for the decisions that would unknowingly prevent you from getting it. Chad is my, uh, hundo percent save file protection, my insurance. Hey, Danger Death. It's your dog's birthday? Oh! He turns 13 today and is a very good boy. Well, that makes today a very special day, then! Did he get a hot dog cake? Ah! 
<laughs> this, this drum, these drum lines are interesting. This game in general sounds way more like 90s grunge than just like the 80s hair metal or synth metal of Mega Man X. Um, it sounds like it's trying to be taught like current, musically current with uh, like grunge rock of the 90s. There's a little synth line back there. But there's a lot more just like sound gardeny sounding guitar licks in this game. the last week and a half playing through the Crystal Dynamics Tomb Raider trilogy for the first time. Not sure where I never got to them before. They're quite good. Do you mean the, like the reboot trilogy? Or are you talking like Tomb Raider 1 and Tomb Raider 2? I think it stopped being Crystal Dynamics by 4? It's practically Black Hole Sun. <laughs> yeah, I was like, maybe I'm overstating it a little bit. Maybe. I think I need the gun upgrade to get some work done here. Let me write that down in my super, super duper notepad. One of these days, like, I'm surprised I haven't doxxed myself or anyone else with the portraits or the previews of alt tab. I know you can turn it off, but. Oh, you notice the seal plushie? Yeah, there's a squishy boy back there. Very cute. Named it Morton. Good name for a squishy plushy guy. Eh. Oh, that, hey, that seemed to work. Yeah. Do I have another life? I do. I have many lives. Oh, he got me. Oh, he got me. I personally kind of hate that iPhones won't show you the text you got or you get if it's not unlocked. I'm not a scumbag. Just show me so enough to wait for face unlock. Huh. That's interesting. At least on Android, you can customize what notifications will show when the phone is locked and which ones don't show. So that's pretty cool. Kind of weird that they just make that decision for you, but I don't know. That's also... It's also a pretty Apple thing to do. They usually err on the side of caution when it comes to guiding the user experience, and it works. Oh, maybe you can and I'm just lazy? Okay, maybe it's worth looking at then. Maybe maybe poke through uh, poke through settings or something. Oh, geez. Okay, buddy. That's an interesting, like... I guess they're using... That's how they're using FX chip to do, like, a... Almost like a shader. That's a cool effect. Yeah, because it's like, there's like opacity. Crossfade. And we bopped him. Yellow Devil from Mega Man 1 is a god-awful boss fight. Yes, it is. That's why everybody hates it. And then it keeps showing up. But yeah, you just have to kind of jump through a whole platforming thing multiple times. Guitar sting when you finish the stage is so menacing. You get Tornado Fang. I bet that can get through the uh, cracked boxes. Maybe. Where was the box factory? I think there were some in this stage. But I can keep poking around. Do 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 do. Hmm. I need to find the. I need to find some more armor upgrades. I need the gun. Do neon tiger. Oh. I didn't. Crush crawfish. Want to listen to some Guns and Roses? We'll get over there. 
I don't think I beat him. I got I got the heart tank in that stage. Stage that has the like under underwater part. Of it. The on Tiger stage is literally just my Michelle by Guns N' Roses. All right. I don't have any of the mechs either. Although I recall there only being like one or two instances where you needed one to get an upgrade. I think I missed my window for enjoying the old Tomb Raider games. These are pretty okay with old games, but those original Tomb Raider games are clunky. Yes, they are. I mean, there was another remake. I think it was Tomb Raider Anniversary. That was kind of a remake of Tomb Raider 1. That one's pretty playable and still kind of has the, the like, steering Lara Croft feeling. Oh, well, well then. Drill. No. <laughs> it just bonks off. That's so pathetic. Acid it. No. Gravity well it. Nope. It's just so sad. You just probably get it. Doink. Alright. Well, that's that then. Why is Mega Man 3 so difficult compared to every other game in the series? Uh, there, Mega Man 9 is pretty hard. But yes, 3 is pretty challenging. I think they were just evolving on for Mega Man 2, kind of noticing that, I guess, people... What I find fascinating about it is, is the volume of levels it delivers. Like, it really goes above and beyond in terms of broadening the content scope of a Mega Man game. And I think that's part of what makes it more difficult, is that it's so long, and that it reuses tile sets for, like, even more challenging stages, and tries to cram in, like, additional boss patterns and stuff like that. They were just trying to, I think, go, go bananas with it. Say three is difficult per se. I well, I think it's got a it's got a more realized difficulty curve and difficulty experience than maybe just a collection of sort of stage mechanics that are neat ideas and kind of incidentally very difficult. Two have bullshit, but three is just constant bullshit. It's it's pretty it's pretty even in terms of it's like yeah, it's difficulty pace. I like three a lot. Three is three to me is is kind of the the package coming together, the music, the stage design, the weapon design, the dash, or, or the slide. Excuse me, adds a lot. Dash is fun. It really is. It's just a fun mechanic. Fun movement tech. looking around really hyper explore mode trying to see if there's anything around Medic, later. thank you for the cheer oh reminding me I forgot to uh, open my business hold on we didn't even hear from Barney Glad I got this old sidearm on me, aren't on you? It's so strange. Come on, we'll get there. We'll get there. Yeah. Oh, that was it. Okay, I'll wait here and help else? anyone else who comes by. Nice of you to show up this morning, Calhoun. 
Yeah, yeah, I know. Problems Come on, with Gordon. the access system. You trying to get me into Hope trouble? You're ready for a long shift. I am. Oh wait, you guys are hearing him. Sorry, that was that was probably doubled up there. Three Barney lines. I always want to make sure people get their Barney lines for their for their value. Uh, can't stay again. Have work. Last night was busy, so tonight will probably be busy as well. Be safe out there, everyone. Have a great stream. Well, thank you very much, medic. Um, sorry about that. Yeah, I know you were talking about how the holidays can be rough for people. So, thank you for getting out there and trying to help people however you can. I mean, I know it's your job too, but still. You know, I'm still kind of pissed off that healthcare workers didn't get a holiday or anything out of the fucking pandemic. Like, couldn't, couldn't they just at least have had a holiday? A National Day of Remembrance or something? That was shitty. I guess everybody just kind of wanted to move on as fast as possible. Nobody wants to think about it or acknowledge it anymore. They got claps at sporting events? Yeah. We recorded a heartfelt song for you. I mean, it's like, I thought it would be free, free points, but I guess, I guess even like, Jesus Christ, even like so declaring a national day of thanks for healthcare workers, I guess would even be seen, could even be twisted into being negative somehow. Yeah, they should have holiday danger death, right? They should. <laughs> they fucking should. Yes. I thought it was going to happen. I'd like, I was like, oh, somebody's going to want free points, right? Some politicians just gonna be like, and I declare today healthcare worker day. And it doesn't mean shit, but I thought somebody was gonna do it. So like maybe at least healthcare workers can like, I don't know, get 20% off pancakes that day. Denny's has like a show your work ID, get a free egg, something like that. Something real American. Well, whatever. Healthcare workers get free channel points here. At a, at a rate that's very similar to the, to the rate that everybody else gets. I made a channel points here. <laughs> Quick trip gives me a soda if I'm in uniform. Well, that's something. It's not much, but it's something. Free bowl of grits. Yeah. Free gruel. How many lives do I have? None. Okay, well. If I can find his weakness, maybe this will go quick. That's already been a thing. This is not. Let's see. Yeah, I have E-Tanks. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. No! Oh. Nothing. Ow. Yeah. 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 drill through his armor, of course. It didn't it didn't drill through at all! Ow! It's doing nothing! Bouncing right off. Okay. Frost. Chop! I mean, it hit him. But it didn't do a whole lot aside from that. I don't know. Ugh. I guess I can might as well try it. Oh, he chopped me. He's chopping me. <laughs> He's going to town on me. Ow, ow, ow. Okay. Oh, shit. I was getting the short end of his pattern like every time. All right, well, that's lame. Neon Tiger it is. Uh, I already got the... Yeah, I got a, got a heart tank here, but I still need everything else. Yes, no spoiling weaknesses. No spoiling anything. Oh, mixed stimulation. Thanks for the sub. Great name. I 
there's a capsule? No? Never mind. You already defeat Vile. Yes. Yeah, I did that. Beat him up in escape sequence. Right in that area. Huh. Acid it. Gravity wallet. Spike it. Wait, is it working? It's working. All right. Enter this capsule, X. Take this X Buster upgrade. The upgrade will increase the strength of your charged shots. You will be able to shoot two charged shots at once. If timed correctly, you can overlap the shots to create a single cross charge shot. The upgrade will also allow you to charge any special weapon. I did it. I'm pretty sure the gravity well charged is like 80% of the stage interactions in this game. Bussy Chungus, thanks for the sub. I'll do my two-handed Kamehameha. Hoo hoo. Gun has like fins on it now. Great. Great. Do, 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 do. Oh, never mind. I thought it was the other guy. Oh, dude, I'm still waiting for it. I wonder if each shot has the power of one Mega Buster. smug little worm bot he is. Ow. Alright. At least he came into the middle of the screen for maximum visibility of his own demise. Appreciate that. Ugh. Hello from Poland. Hey, I got a Wargo yesterday. Great. Really enjoyed it. Met a new character. Gained uh, further appreciation of the uh, the character work they're doing with Kratos and Atreus in that game. Hints. Both the attacks are too big. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh, all right. Maybe you just gotta you gotta have your gun like rammed up in there. So the hitbox just spawns. Yeah, maybe that's how to do it. Damn it! That does seem to be the, the magic trick. Huh. All right. I really hope I solved the secret of 
bit and bite or whatever. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I got, a, got like six hours in on God of War yesterday. It was awesome. And I plan to play it more tonight. You set me up to play some Dark Tide, which I, of course I'm excited to do. Mm. So I'm going to be doing that, he said at 3 o'clock, which is in about an hour. Yeah. Class. I think I tried to jump up there and there wasn't anything. Which would actually make putting spikes on that little edge really annoying. Turn to Castle Wolfenstein is on Game Pass. I'm playing that tonight. Huh! Does it got them Chivos? Probably not, since it came out before. Like it would, it never had achievements, so I don't. I wouldn't guess that they would add them, unless it's like a re-release or something. And I don't think it is. There was something up there. Huh. Just got back from a nine-hour train ride to surprise my girlfriend. So back home with a cold beer. Listening to the whole city go crazy because Poland won in a match today. I hear some of that uh, going on in my neighborhood, too. I've heard some Vuvuzelas go off. Alright, let me see here. One second. All right. Do 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 do. So, hmm. I'm pretty sure it's not gravity well, but I got to try, right? Ha! Huh. Ooh. Does nothing. Okay. Maybe T-Fang? T-Fang! Fang him up, boys! Mm, no. Definitely not. Frost. Although I think I discovered this weakness. I don't think his pattern is really all that bad, though. I could just bust him in there. Yeah. Alright, I got two lives and the dregs at the bottom of the sub tank. Dumb thing to get hit by. Stop it! <laughs> Do I just need to be closer? I don't know why that keeps tagging me. That's so dumb. Maybe I should, uh... I should just get up on the wall for that. Hey, Christian. And then I can just drop uh, whenever he does his, his dash, because it seems like there's plenty of time. Okay, that one does hit the corner. Ugh. Oh my god, I swear I'm going to learn this eventually. Oh my god, just stop jumping. Just don't jump. All I have to do is not jump. There. Okay, I got it. <laughs> ah, I don't got it! <laughs> uh, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. <laughs> Spontaneous brain shut down. Ah, uh, let's draw it! That's the only thing I learned from two days in Poland. Damn it. No!
God damn it. I didn't turn around. Whoa. Oh, the disrespect. Incredible. How does it change the pattern of his bullets? Oh, it does. That's interesting. Okay, well. The good news is, is I got the gun upgrade. Now I can get more upgrades. And potentially get weaknesses. So, let's see. I have the... Put my gravity well theory to the test. I remember punching the ground and that making the rocks fall down. I'm gonna go back to the catfish though, let's see. Oh, the F word in Polish? I did I did hear something that I looked up and I was like, oh okay, they're just swearing. It's just like a it's just like a bleh. Uh I, I can't remember. I just heard some old man like say it under his breath. And I was like, oh. I know what that sounds like. See Return of Dancing Jar Jar <laughs> Pepe. Yeah. I suppose. I think he's still in my still in my archives somewhere. Okay, let's try this. Just have to wait until it comes back to like Oh, that's the one. Thank you, Reardon. Alright. A little spiky guy. Oh, you just get a drill hand. Damn, that burns through energy so fast, though. Oh. Alright. You like the bubblegum pastel colors? Yeah. A little vapor wavy. enemies have like just enough time to fire one shot if you just are button mashing and try to shoot them to death. They always like take one little nick out of you. Here. I need to settle an argument for me. A longer one, so I don't know if I can take up your time. Nothing offensive. Yeah, go for it. I will 
Oh, whoa! Okay, I can get this. I I will fairly judge. As I always do. Okay. That's half the hard tanks. Did you help me hide a body? I'll be there in four minutes. Put on the coffee. Oh, I'm making another batch of cold brew right now. Although I looked online and it like it said that the ratio of grounds to water and cold brew is supposed to be four to one. Which is like four parts uh water to one part coffee. But like that's way like I can't even fit that many grounds in the cold brew pitcher that I have. If I actually try to keep to that ratio. But I don't know. I just grabbed up as much coffee as, as would fit in there, but I got a nice batch cold brewing in the fridge as we speak. So tomorrow is going to be a beautiful day. Here we go! Yes, I can ride the puck up if I use the gravity wheel. Pretty sure That's how this works. Hiya! I ascend! Beautiful. Enter this capsule, Lex. Take this armor upgrade. The upgrade will decrease the damage done to your systems. As you receive damage, a defensive field will be generated to protect you. Oh yeah, you get a you get more damage and vulnerability. Got shoulder pads. I can't remember what the uh. What is the um? What does the helmet upgrade do in this game? And two, it helped you find items. So I guess I'm curious to find out what that is. In America, when we grill, we use coal or wood to grill. In America, you guys often use gas grills, but isn't a gas grill just an outdoor stove? It should not be called a grill. My understanding is that the grill refers specifically to the manner of cooking, which is to say, like, a hot grate that you're cooking on. So what what heats the grate, I'm not sure factors into the, the naming so much. It's on hot metal bars. Guess what? You're grilling. But yeah, cooking with things that aren't gas, or propane, if you will, do imply more flavor. Now, in your opinion, perhaps, cooking on cooking with gas and not uh, not adding any of the flavor cooking over wood or coal may exclude it from, uh, from proper grilling in your mind. In fact, fortunately, I'd, I don't know. I don't know if that applies to greater verbiage. There might be people who agree with you, though. I'm not, uh... Unfortunately, I'm not passionate about the act of grilling, so I'm not, uh... As a, as a fair judge in this circumstance, I'm afraid I must rule that it is grilling. But that doesn't mean you have to like it. it doesn't mean you have to like it. it. Doesn't mean you have to acknowledge it or respect it. Air fry my burgers only. I ha oh, I, I have an air fryer, but I haven't used it for anything yet. But you can use it for literally everything, right? can put anything in an air fryer and it gets better and more delicious. That's my understanding. Ow. Right. Not gonna be bad. Might be the drill. It is the drill. Excellent.
Now he's wondering how this could have happened. Sorry, buddy. Can I fry my paycheck in an air fryer so that it gets better? Yes. It actually increases its value. Air fry your check, then take it into the bank. We'll give you a bonus. They'll snap off a little piece of it and eat it and be like, mm. That's worth 20% more. It's a bit... I understand why, but it's a bit of a shame that the pre-rendered X back here doesn't change based on the armor upgrades you get. That would be so sick. If you get the, like, splash, the high-res splash of Mega Man X wearing the new gear as you pick it up. Uh, I never played the Mega Man games back in the day. I always wondered, were you supposed to figure out the optimal order to defeat bosses and get the good weapons versus other bosses via trial and error, like a replayability thing? Um, I mean, maybe, yeah. Knowing the order certainly makes the experience a bit different. But I, I think trial and error is a valid way to play the game. And slowly figuring out... Slowly getting weapons. And then testing them against bosses and finding the order kind of pays off in the boss rush at the end of the game. So, I think there's, there's an... There's an implied arc there over the course of a single playthrough. I just think it's it's done knowing that you're going to flop around in the levels and not know what you're doing. You're, you're going to have to like try out a few levels at random to see what feels like. Not only can you get through the stage pretty smoothly, but I feel like you have a shot against the boss. Blast Hornet! song is rad too. Do, do, do. Part of me wants to get a little grumpy that I don't have... Oh! I think I've already made it over there. I'm pretty sure I already went back there. Oh, that was that was right. It's a chip, but it's one that I couldn't get before. But based on the sage wisdom of chat, I'm not going to get the chips. Because there's a more delicious chip later. A more filling chip with more nacho flavor. That's what I'm waiting for. The ultimate nacho experience. You just gotta say no to what's right in front of you. Let that be a lesson to you. I want a trademark piece of Lawrence wisdom here. Don't eat the first Dorito you see. Or, uh, you know, maybe eat all the Doritos. Make sure the first Dorito you see doesn't prevent you from eating a more or delicious Dorito in the future. There we go. There we go. That makes sense. The way that I said that. Oh. Oh. Oh! Damn it. Oh! Shit! I just accidentally guessed this guy's pattern last time, and I'm just getting embarrassed. Pop Tart, I think that emote signifies Nacho quite well. Eat all Doritos that come into eyesight. Dori Doritos, Nacho Cheese Doritos might be the most broadly palatable, widely enjoyed chip. So there's Takis. Those might be pretty regional though. Oh yeah, I can drill too. Drill baby drill. Mega Man loves oil. I mean, he's a robot man. He ought to. Here we go. It's interesting. You can see some like some sprite scaling. 
This game has kind of a mishmash of, of pixel resolutions. Maybe it doesn't. Maybe it doesn't, never mind. Maybe it actually doesn't at all. It sort of looks like it sometimes. I know people who hate tackies don't know anyone who hates Doritos. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, that's kind of where my head goes to. There we go. Why did it change me into... Definitely know people who would say no to a Taki. I don't think anybody I've ever met would say no. Would you? Oh, they were about to kill me. Say no to a Dorit. So does this mean I just... No, wait, that's not Dash. Does this mean I just get him forever? This guy, can I summon him at mech pads now? Also, addendum. What happens if I go down this pit? Hey. Oh. Nothing. All right. Huh. Also, this asks a lot of interesting questions. Mega Man X is a, a being with sentience and free will, theoretically, and yet he is with two jo joysticks working a pantomime of himself. Zathras 2. Thank you very much for the sub. And yet, you're thanking me for my hard gaming, hot takes, and wisdom in all things. So brave. Yes. Yes, I, uh, I, I understand that I was called on this earth to do one thing. And it's, uh, it's play video games and solve everyone's problems. Ah, oh, shit, he's gone. Well, okay. So the whole, there's really no point then. To having that robot in this arena or this area. You don't take him and do anything with him. Right? There's no like wall I can punch through. If there was, I abandoned my robot friend before I did. What about bonding with the robot? I guess we bonded then. Well, mission accomplished there. Oh, good. I get to wipe his ass now. Nice to meet you, X. I'm Bite. I've been programmed to exterminate you. He sounds like the bear from Mega Man 7. Eight? Ow. All right. He's got windmill punch? Damn, okay. Shit, bro! <laughs> God damn it. Stop it! I don't even understand what he's doing. He's working he's working a weird spell on me. Oh, he's putting down like an attractor. Okay. I, I think he might kill my ass. Huh. Okay, so you just want to jump when you put that thing down. Damn it! It. Well, does that mean he's gonna... Wait a minute. Okay. That means he's gonna spawn there. And maybe I can... Maybe I can farm out sub-tanks here and just deal with it. Oh. Styles. Interesting. What are the implications of defeating Bite permanently? He won't appear in the later stages. Does that mean I miss out on lore or dialogue? The most vital thing for a Mega Man game? Cosmic Slop. Thank you very much for the sub. These dudes do 
not drop health. Ugh. I don't know if, like, the Missile Mans, I don't think I've, I've ever seen drop health. The little Grasshopper guys seem to, though. These guys. Lose enjoying a couple of drinks and some hard gaming? Oh, yeah. That was me yesterday. I don't think I'm going to be drinking today. But that's okay. I got a I got a toasty fireplace ready to go right behind me. And it's going to go. Damn it. I got to stop taking damage. Uh. Maybe it's maybe just getting good would be faster in this circumstance. So what determines whether I'm actually asking, I guess, because it just seems so invisible. What determines whether or not they appear in a stage? like twice. God damn it. Yeah, I just need to not get hit. It's that simple. I just maybe need to stay sliding on the wall and then do the one jump when he starts to dash. Because I don't think it knocks me off the wall. Ah! But that means I have to be on the wall when he shoots it. Stop it! Ah! Fuck you! you! Can't do that. You can't get over him that way. Ugh. Catches you on one weird jump. It fucks your entire rhythm. Ugh. Alright. Hmm. Watching you play this makes me think about whether my love for FromSoft games now comes from loving Mega Man as a kid and fighting bosses that reward pattern recognition. They're very similar games. Um, yeah. Souls and Mega Man. Boss fights, very identical from a mechanical perspective. Same idea, like... Each boss has its own biome that you go to, 
and they have sort of like hit secrets hidden in their areas that might require items from another boss's kind of zone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember playing Demon Souls and being like, this feels like like a really dark and gritty Mega Man, um, just with no gun arm. So yeah, pretty pretty astute, I think. Snip, snip. Snip, snip. I don't think I've gotten any new upgrades since I came to the stage last. I think. I just need to go beat up crawfish. I think. Punch. Yeah, I remember that. Maybe I need a mech to punch through this? Hmm. Okay. Let's go see if I can find a, a robot buddy now that I have one unlocked. It would have to be in this zone. Just FYI to chat. Uh, I'm open to taking 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 some guidance, but my own personal desire. Uh, I feel like honoring it. It's to oh here we go. To really just sort of warn me when I'm about to miss something, miss something that I can't go back and get later. That's that's uh, that's what I would prefer. So beyond that. Please don't just spell out anything out for me. Or just straight up tell me what things are. If you could. Alright, punch through that shit. Man. There we go. Thanks, buddy. Oh, it's a chip. Who cares? Enter this capsule, X. Install this body chip. This chip will increase your defensive ability. Defensive shields will be enhanced and you will receive even less damage. Remember, X, your system can handle only one of the four enhancement chips. Enter this capsule only if you are sure you want to use this chip. I don't. Get out of here, old man. I'm done with you. game would you like to forget so you could play it for the first time again? Hmm. I'm gonna say Undertale. Although, like, hmm, Deus Ex would be nice. Bioshock was pretty cool the first time. Or maybe like a Final Fantasy VI, maybe Final Fantasy VII. Although the, I feel like the punch would be different because a good part of the the wow factor of playing like seven for the first time was just kind of the visuals, the music. It was such a such a technical level that other games didn't quite have. I don't. So if it's like I've never played seven, but I'd be playing it with my modern brain, that wouldn't quite be the same as playing it in like 1999. Lost Odyssey, I really, really liked. It's a 
were having a really sentimental experience with that game. Nice. Yes, that supercharge had better one-shot the, the engine. That's the coolest thing it can do. Crisis Core looking good? Yeah? Yeah, they seem to be uh, investing in brushing up all the Jason Final Fantasy VII things. It's now fully its own franchise, which is, I guess, good. People, people wanted more of it. It's getting the Star Wars treatment. All right. I beat up on these crowd. I, uh, I don't think I have... Well, maybe it's electric. I think I have a new one new weapon. Triad Trinity Trap Trapperl. Damn it, stop it, stop it. Okay, yeah, I can do that. Stop it. Whatever. Who needs skill? more JRPGs the better. I'm so hyped for Dragon Quest. Yeah, I haven't even, I haven't even beat 11. I'm hoping to fit that in over like in December sometime. December to me, ideally it's collect, it's like Callisto Protocol and then it's Yakuza. I want to get through the Yakuza series. At the rate I play games though, that's probably more than enough for an entire month. However, I would also like to, to just bash through a bunch of cozy JRPGs. And then like by the time February rolls around, there's going to be tons more game releases. Oh baby. All right. Well, I have more tools now. Yeah, so gotta be God of War Ragnarok. I'm hoping to do that before the end of November, but that might also be, that might also be uh, really aggressive for me. Also given that I'm not playing it right now. Uh, damn it, dude. Making a mockery of me. <laughs> Shit! Is this one of the rock areas? Well... a robot. I think it was for this, yeah. But I got up here anyway. And now the robot's gone. I don't know if there's a punch wall. I think there is. Ooh. Kalako Coke. Kalak. Mm. Damn it. I wanted to get it right the first time. Palaco Coco, thank you very much for the prime. I feel like there wasn't there wasn't an underscore in your name before. Oh sh oh, yes. thought it was gonna go down for a second. It's not going down at all. Does he just randomly jump up? Loco Cocoa. Okay, so it's not just Coco? Cocoa, all right. Thank you for the, uh, thank you for the phonetic spelling.
Oh, he's still here. Okay. Doing a lot of damage, never mind. Yeah, I think I can get away with that. No, how could this great power be generated from within such an ancient machine? Well done, X. The victory is yours. He respects me. The very first try, too. Without any guidance or hints at all. Rock hard skill. That's kind of interesting. So if you kill them with their weakness, they explode instead of running away. Seems so suspicious, these areas. There's gotta be secrets around here somewhere, right? Maybe. Pretty sure I definitely tried to climb up all of those before. Right after I slap this guy around, I'm gonna have to take a break. It's set up for Dark Tide. You just shoot your butt at me? You squirt, squirt your butt at me? Hey, Gamunra, what's up? Whoa, sprites! Seems like it's doing more than one HP of damage. But I'm not sure that it's the weakness. Jesus! Stop it! Maybe this will suck up all the bees? Okay, there we go. Right, Doppler thought he was one step ahead of me with the bees. Oh, oh god, he almost got me. Little did he know, I control the power of gravity. Bees require gravity to fly. Look at this, like there's a bee helicopter back there. Why wasn't he in his bee copter? He's just hanging out in his office, kicked in the door, shot him in the face. Dang it, I didn't even get to use my bee helicopter. Sucks, bro. It's my helicopter now. You have a favorite Warhammer fan fiction? Uh, I have not read a lot of Warhammer lore, although I should, because I really I think the setting is really fun, and could could like paint the. It's a good setting for like some um, like goofy, but still with a chance to provide actual commentary. So it can like it can be fun, but it can also be serious kind of kind of mixture. So I'm all about that. All right, I'm writing down my password here. Three, six, five, six. Very well. Okay. I think there's one more stage to beat. I need to find four more hard tanks and a couple, like the the helmet upgrade. A couple more things. Okay. Oh, not fan fiction. Oh, you just said faction. I don't know why I saw fan fiction. Whatever. Uh, the answer is also no, because I'm not as studied on the lore as I would like to be to have a favorite. I apologize, I completely misread <laughs> your message. Uh, now, fictions in general, I have not consumed. I need to read more of the books. People say Horus Heresy is a really good place to start, so maybe I'll pick that up. Alright, break time. I'm gonna come back and uh, we'll get some Warhammer going. I'm gonna get this, uh, this, this... I gotta have a fire for the Emperor, too, so I'll be right back. See you guys soon.